Divine Masculine, okay, let's see what's going on with you today. Y'all know how we do situation, action, outcome. Wow, that flew in my face. That's the Page of Cups. One second. <laughs> that energy, Divine Masculine, flew across the room. Page of Cups, you're ready to reach out, okay? This is after you walk away from a situation that was no longer serving you here with the Eight of Cups energy. And you've been wanting to contact your Divine Feminine. You've been wanting to reach out. You've been wanting to say something. But you always felt like the time never came. Like it wasn't right timing. You had a lot to sort out. But Father was letting you know and you're finally listening that once you walk away from a situation, he sorts these things out himself. Okay? What's the action for Divine Masculine here? Five of Cups. Okay? Because you were very much so depressed over the situation. Whatever happened in the past, it kept you bound. You kept looking behind. You kept looking back. Instead of turning around and seeing these Two of Cups. Two of Cups is union. Two of Cups is balance. Two of Cups is being in alignment with yourself. Okay? And so your action, and I feel like you've already succeeded with this, is to get over that depression. Go to the point of acceptance. Acceptance. Y'all know I always say the Five of Cups is the five stages of grief. You can't move forward until you go through all five steps. However, you do have to stop looking back at the past. Stop crying over spilled milk. Things have happened in the past for your highest good. And you're being instructed to move forward. Make that step. Make that bold step forward. Make that communication, okay? What's the outcome here? We got the seven of swords. Yeah, because for too long, you've lied to yourself. For too long, you've lied to others. You've deceived yourself. You, you had on this mask pretending that everything's okay, I'm fine, I'll be fine. But Father's saying that it wasn't fine and it hasn't been for a long time. Eight of Cups, I'm hearing eight months, eight weeks. It's been a while since you truly felt that sense of happiness, that love within yourself. And Father is saying that you know that once you move past this grief over the past, forgiving yourself because you hadn't done that in a long time you haven't forgiven yourself you haven't loved on yourself you haven't let go of past situations and things and how things happened which what was said but i'm seeing that you're ready now i'm seeing that you're ready to move forward divine masculine here bottom of the deck energy is the four of cups because life isn't life without your person you just won't accept it without your person being around is what i'm hearing Four of Cups is here. It's just like, life is like blah without your person. I'm hearing blah, mm, meh, you know? And that's your truth, but you haven't been living in your truth. You've been deceiving yourself. And with that being said, you've been deceiving other people as well. You know, telling your family that this situation that you were in was okay. Telling your whoever you were with that that was okay. Telling your job that you were okay with that. And now your job and everything else, it just doesn't make sense without your person. Unhappiness at its finest, okay? But the good part about it, Divine Masculine, is that you're moving forward. You're letting the past go. You're letting all of that go, okay? Let's get a spirit animal for Divine Masculine. Spirit animal for Divine Masculine for today, Father. Give me a spirit animal. And we got the dragon, supernatural. Yeah, you had to make some big, major changes in your life. And it had to start with you, though. Miracles is what I'm hearing. You had to believe in miracles. Your faith had to be that big. 333, three, three, as I say that on the timer. You are the ancient wise sage. You can be shape shift at will. Mastery is your destiny. Rise with dignity. So victory is here. You have to rise out of that comfort zone. Out of the place where you felt like it was okay to stay in. And now you're like, no, I gotta go. I gotta pick it up and go. Let's get an angel card to support this reading father for Divine Masculine. What do they want? What kind of support do the angels have for them? Spiritual support. I so crazy because I need spiritual support. Dear angels, I allow you to support me as I grow and become more spiritually aware. So like I said, Divine Masculine, 333 is your number this, this today. It is absolutely letting you know that the angels are on your side. That's so crazy because there are three little bulbs here, three little angels here, all in support of you. Because they want to see you happy. They want to see you make it. They want to see you rise above all of it. Rise above it because they want to see you happy, okay? Let's get a hidden truth here. And that's so crazy because I've grabbed this deck before. 
I started this reading and I see that you've been lying to yourself here. And then it says, I didn't see, you didn't see my tears. You've been sad about this for a long time, Divine Masculine, without your Divine Feminine. And you know, you, you've you been crying about it. You have shed some tears over this situation, over this love, but you tried to pretend like it was okay. You were like, no, nope, I'm gonna pretend like everything's fine. This is you pretending, but this is you in sadness. Look at this person in depression, sadness, very much so. But Father has your back, okay? He won't let you stay in a situation where you absolutely have the strength to get out of. Let's get a um, card for Divine Masculine. What would you like to tell your feminine? The Empress. I told you this is all about your Divine Feminine. The Empress. I know who you are. Your nurturing power is guiding me home. So you're ready to leave. You're ready to come home is what I saw here. You know, you're ready to let go of this past situation, whatever the situation was. It didn't make you happy. So now you're ready to reach out. You're becoming more spiritually aware that you need more spiritually. It's not about the physical, although that's a, I'm hearing a bonus. You know, you, you feel like your divine feminine is divine. Divine love here. And your heart is open to this. But spiritually now you're seeing that you can't be without this, okay? That's what I have for you, Divine Masculine. I hope this information helped and blessed. Let's go to Divine Feminine. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Next video.